Guys, welcome to my channel. Uh, we this is our this is my th third or fourth try to uh, show you 3.23 on EPTU, but every time I have some problems with the uh, with everything. My server is crashing. Uh, I'm stuck in, in textures of the game. Uh, and last time, for some reason, my uh, video program I'm using for recording uh, just died with me <laughs> um, and my video for one hour stuck. So let's try new program. It will be in 1080p, but still you will see everything. Uh, let me start from the beginning. If you want to skip any part of this video, use time codes under the video. If you're a guest of our channel, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more stuff like this. If you are my subscriber, I welcome you, my brother. Don't forget to press like button. So, again, I spent uh, four hours total trying to make videos for you guys. Every time I have lots of problems. If, you, if you're watching this video in my YouTube channel, then I finally made it. Uh, first time, I was so mad at CIG because of the uh, level of uh, clouds in uh, Orison. I was so mad. It was looks like I'm playing uh, Dandy uh, Super Mario or something. Or, or all pixels were, were so crazy bad but okay let's let's go back to our review of 323 uh, of EPTU it's not persistent universe it's test server I get uh, access of uh, EPTU by subscribing of for $12 for some pack I don't know which pack was that but anyway who cares uh, we have this uh, opportunity to, to, to test this uh, new patch. Uh, so main um, changes you can see is to the left. M most of you already know these changes, yes? We have UI changes, we have uh, physics changes, we have EVA changes, uh, water physics and graphic changes. Right now I'm using Vulkan render. Uh, I'm not using upscaling because in my uh, like you can see 37 right now if I will use uh, auto it will still be the same so uh, it, it's it's not changing at all but if you will press uh, volumetric clouds to photo mode we have 36 right now we will have less than that even more uh, the reason is volumetric clouds are crazy good and they are crazy uh, resource taken uh, Wait, water number, water number of simulation regions. What is this? Very high. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, before we will start, I am very, very in mixed feelings about this patch. There are very uh, interesting um, changes here. Very. Uh, good changes and there are very bad changes for my personal opinion uh, also we will have server problem I think so uh, and of course I skip the part when we are making our uh, wait wait go back I will skip the part uh, when we creating our guy because I don't see any reason in that you can find someone else making that because you're spending too much time try to make this guy uh, but there are some new faces some new customization for um, your face for your hair for your beard for your makeup if you're picking girl even for your makeup if you're picking boy and all the stuff now we will have some problems with this server about uh, video some uh, some particles of graphics in EPTU uh, are not uh, appearing correctly they can stutter they can look uh, bad uh, but so we we need to be prepared for that second one what I want to say is that uh, this render new render is bring bringing us new uh, 
new graphics. But you will not see this new graphics unless we will go to Harper's Point or somewhere else where you can see uh, mountains, you will see stones, trees and grass. And of course there will be some problems as well, but still it's better graphics than it was. Uh, about ship physics, okay, let's, let's go to our hangar. About ship physics and about this UI. Um, well, okay, this minimap in top left of the bot uh, of the screen is convenient, but uh, not as convenient as I wanted. And for some reason, you can't uh, turn off the uh, UI. I, I mean, this health and uh, right bottom side of the screen. Okay, what about Mobby? In case you didn't saw, we have new Mobby here. I will make it very fast for you if you saw that. Uh, okay, if you didn't saw that, you will see this. Uh, this menu, we have comms here. For some reason, chat is not working right now. Sometimes it's working, sometimes it's not. Just same as in Persistent Universe. Because chat is on different server of the game. Maybe they crashed or something. Uh, we have contracts. I didn't saw new contracts here. Uh, we have a journal. We'll stop on maps uh, later. We have journal. We have assets. We have reputation. Wallet. Still, we, we can't uh, use wallet because we don't have anyone here. Uh, this landing pad and this loadout. I have two ships. One Mustang Alpha and one Origin 600i. Sorry for speaking very fast because it's my third or fourth try and uh, I think we need to go to train station and from there I will try to explain you about our map uh, as I said before you may not see better quality here but just check FPS I have 38 to 40 FPS at new Babbage but usually I had 20 FPS So it's very smooth here uh, I definitely can say we have better FPS here But we still have problems like uh, trains are moving across the uh, walls and all this stuff It's not interesting for us because it's PTU and the game isn't pre-alpha. Don't don't wait to to uh, to, to see uh, way new game here with a new mechanics with like like this <laughs> nothing changes at all at full oh, maybe actually server is dead tell me it will be just fifth time no it's working it's working but it's very um clanky if it's correct word for that uh about graphics here I can definitely tell you that uh, from this point I will spend hours in EPTU trying to show you better graphics in relaxing um, exploration um, journeys my relaxing exploration journeys so what we will test now Wait, I, I forgot to show you we have new map if you are, we are pressing F2, you will... Uh, where are we going? <laughs> Wait. Oh, let's go away from here. Unless we still have time. Oh, sorry. Uh, we have these little maps. You can navigate through them. You can move uh, it closer. Very convenient, but no nothing really... Uh, really un unbelievable for me it's just 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 a map okay if you're uh, scrolling out you will see microtech and you will see this uh, places uh, like cryo processing you will see this new uh, ui with explanation of what you will find there and you can navigate there with your ship but the problem is sometimes it's really buggy and you will not be able to navigate from the first time and you will need to move from for example new babbage to to Cali Caliop or to Clio or to Euterpa to get inside 
some new Babbage's facilities, for example, Raven's Roost, no, not the Raven's Roost, let, let's say Dunborough, uh, or Ghost station. Hollow, or Stand Harper's Point. Oh, by the way, we will not get to Harper's Point right now because it's night there. Or maybe we can. I wanted to show you water physics, but this is it. So right now I wanted to try EVA. Uh, nothing very uh, interesting in UI for me. Just UI, okay. I'm not uh, playing Star Citizen for UI. But maybe for some people who will try to play Star Citizen first time, uh, it will be more convenient for them to find out where they are right now. Because also you can use this uh, minimap uh, on the ship or when you're close to the ship. Even if it's not your ship, you will still have access to this minimap. Uh, no reason to show you graphics here. You will not see the difference, trust me. Not in Microtech, not inside any space station, not inside ships and everything. Uh, but even here... Wait, look at this. Do, do you see this little smog? Smoke, smog. It's lingering... Look at this, it's lingering across the new Babbage and all the other places. I never saw that in Persistent Universe. Maybe I'm wrong and it's still in Persistent Universe as well. No, but this makes uh, effect of... Uh, well... Better graphic effects. Last time I stuck Welcome in textures. Let's hope... We will not wait too long for our origin. No, we will have to wait very long time. Let's rent other ship. Let's take Constellation. Wow! Who are you, bro? Pyrotechnic ama amalgamated. Okay. I made so many screenshots. You will not see them from here because I'm using new program to, to show you this game. Oh, by the way, to buy something, you need to come here and just press F and hold. F, wait, wait, wait. F and hold. Yeah. And transaction should be complete. For some reason, uh, menu is in the left side. But I, I don't think this is interesting for you guys. Yeah, we bought that. This is not interesting for me, actually. Th these little transactions. And, uh... No. I don't want to spend your time on that. Because this video will take uh, hours trying to explain you how this works right now. Um, n I don't see reason to take Constellation. Let's take 300. Yeah. to get inside faster and we will have a accessibility to bed. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Remember, your belongings belong to vehicle select your vehicle. Hangar 4. EPTU have lots of bugs. A crazy amount of bugs. Uh, so if we will encounter any bugs, don't uh, don't be disturbed, don't don't be angry, uh, because it's just EPTU. One day we will have it on Persistent Universe, and you will check it yourself. I'm not stopping here. Nothing new here. Uh, you can see map and you can see ship. You cannot actually see ship. You need to press F2, and you will see ship. Guns and uh, how it looks from inside. Like this. I will show you uh, ship physics. And um, clouds. Ship physics, holometric clouds, then EVA, then uh, water physics. If you will see anything there because it's night at Harper's Point. And uh, ground. I will show you ground. Nothing here. 
not, nothing new here. Uh, to sit in a pilot seat, you need to press F. You don't need to press F, hold it, and then press left mouse button. It's faster now. Uh, open hangar is the same. F, uh, Alt plus N. Turning off um, my display info with FPS. See no reason, because I did told you that it's better right now. Okay, engines on. So uh, before we will take off, main and uh, very strange thing for me. Oh, what is this? Main and strange thing for me is that to have faster speed, uh, to move faster in atmosphere you need to spool quantum drive even if you are out of atmosphere let's say you are in cosmos you still need to spool your quantum drive maybe it's because of we are at eptu i don't understand but still we are taking off then we are moving okay Maybe we will not have this uh, in origin. Yeah, it's it's coming across uh, this white spot. Let's turn to the left. You, you can see volumetric clouds right now, left side of us. And you can uh, feel that the ship is moving differently. Not same as it was at uh, in uh, Persistent Universe. But okay, to move faster, you need to turn on quantum drive. Then it will spool from the right side, and only after that, you can see like we are starting to move faster. I don't understand why. Don't ask me. Ask CIG. But it's how it works. And this is volumetric clouds. To see difference between persistent universe and. Uh, yeah, and 323, I mean, patch 2, 322 and 323, I will press uh, volumetric clouds. I mean, uh, photo mode. It will be more FPS demanding, but you will see it differently. Yeah, like, see, like, like this, it's more demanding, but it's more volumetric. Like this. We're actually inside the cloud. It's huge difference between uh, 22 and uh, three, uh, 23 dif uh, patches. Yeah, like that. Uh, let's turn it to very high because it's just for photo. Nice. And when we're picking very high, we have nice FPS, which is around 60, I think. Yeah, so volumetric clouds are one of the main. Um, uh, addition in this patch. Let's move. Uh, by the way, if you use your shift, I mean boost, you will move faster. Yeah, you will move faster. But you will stop slowly if you are not spooling your quantum drive. But if you are spooling your quantum drive, it will get to 100. Your ship will move much way faster. Yeah, like that. And from here you can use shift as well and you will move even more faster so you can now move with uh, I don't understand why let me try to I turned off 
vibration turned off everything but still my ship is very uh, shaking oh, very shaking space brake booster Active throttle access crossing trap time sec I don't say what is this <laughs> the joy dead zones velocity indicator turrets salvage for some reason it's shaking so hard I can do nothing with it and I tried this many times to to do something with it but still you, you can see maybe you will help me to type in the comment section what I did wrong that it's so so shaky in lower uh, when I'm not that fast my ship is not shaking but when I'm getting faster it's just crazy also we have a uh, new camera effect if you are turning uh, moving top or uh, lower y your camera c camera is not following you directly it's just it have some few seconds uh, few milliseconds before it will change okay yeah. for those who, who playing this very long as I do or v very lots of hours you understand what I'm meaning okay now let's let's go in the space I will try to, uh, to show you EVA this origin is so freaking fast What is his maximum speed? What? What? 1.4 thousand? Oh wow So origin speed is 1.4 It was 1.1, now it's 1.4. Okay. And when you're turning off... <laughs> when you're turning off your quantum drive, it's just moving to 260 for some reason. No idea. I don't understand why. Now, when we're turning it on... It will spool to 100 and will move. Yeah, like that. Okay, let's go to the space station. Oh, wait, we actually 100 kilometers away from the ground. We can try. What? Wh why are we moving? Just stop. Yeah, let, let's just turn off the uh, quantum drive. It will stop automatically. And engines. Uh, I mean. Oh. We have new weapons here. Okay, let's try to get outside. Wait, how much do I have? 60, 70 FPS in Microtech? Close to Microtech? Crazy. Okay. Exit, 0G. Wow, I just get from there and didn't, I'm not pressing anything right now and I'm still moving. So this is EVA. Now let's go there.
Ha, oh, nice. This is first time I'm trying uh, trying EVA actually. Now you can be like a ship. But outside of your ship. Very interesting. Uh, c can we shoot? Ah, I, <laughs> I don't have ammunition, sorry. <laughs> I used everything for my last video. Yeah, it's very, very... How to say... Smooth. <laughs> Open fire! <laughs> Imagine I'm shooting. Now, can, uh, can you open door, please? Oh, w when when you are trying to hit your ship, he will open his ha hand to s to stop hit, stop the hit. Why are you closing doors? They need to add this uh, heat effect when he's hitting the. Um oh yes, nice. After you entering, let's try it again. He's just stopping. Oh come on! After you entering a uh, ship, it's just stopping and using his legs. Yeah, like that. This is it. Okay. Oh. So you you can get inside your pilot seat from third person, coming closer and pressing F. Yes. You don't need to to change uh, your view to third from third person to first person to enter the uh, the ship okay whatever uh, let's hope you understood what I'm trying to say uh, now I will show you the main bug for now which I will uh, which I hope they will change we will try to navigate to Harper's point where we have a little um, lake it will take some time. Done, bro. Okay. Harper's Point. We are navigating to Harper's Point, but, but uh, it's saying I need to go from my current location first to Microtech. You can see, which is 98 kilometers from me, 96. And then I need to navigate to Harper's Point. But the problem is, I am at Microtech, and when I'm spooling my quantum drive, it still wants me to navigate to Microtech. I was so... F f uh, it was so hard for me to understand what should I do in this case. So I decided to try, move from this place to, let's say, Calliope. And navigate to there. When we navigate it to Kelyop, we're jumping there. Maybe this will help for those guys who are on the e EPTU as well. So we're jumping to Kelyop, and from there we are. Um, Also, I forgot to say that you can use search button here if you want to find a particular place. We are pressing Harper's Harper's point from here, from Kalyop, and um, pressing root. So now we can turn around. Turn around, turn around. What do you see? Here I am, here I am. And now we will not have that bug. I don't understand why they did that, but it's just... 
like, you know, <laughs> Star Citizen. It's CIG. Okay, now from here we are navigating to Harper's Point. We will move all planets around. And there is no sun, so I'm not sure we will see a water effect, but I want I still want to, to show it. Also, it will be my first time uh, moving around Microtech at night. We will check night effects as well. Maybe they changed something. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's be very carefully. I want to show you night microtech. Let's go. We are moving with a speed almost 800 meters per second in atmosphere for those of you who are playing this for a very long time you understand that you will understand that it's crazy fast okay we're closing to the um, lake there was a c2 uh, i mean not c2 spirit oh by the way uh, to scan the area you need to press tab Where am I? I should be at Harper's Point. Oh, okay, okay, I finally found it. Okay, now I'm turning off Quantum Drive. Let's shoot in the water. Okay, okay. I can't shoot? Ah. Uh, So, <laughs> nobody attacked me, I didn't hit the ground, I was just in... So this is the reason why I'm starting every time from the beginning. I propose you to watch this part, okay, and next part, when it will be daytime at Harper's Point, I will make a video uh, with me exploring universe, what your physics looks like, and you will tell me... <laughs> what the hell is this? I am died again? I died even in my hospital? Yes, I died two times. You can't make this video. So, anyway, thank you guys for watching. I will leave uh, water and um, ground graphics with uh, exploration. For, for the next video. Oh, finally I'm alive. Thank you. Don't forget to press like button and subscribe on my channel. Good luck, guys.